My God, the power of prophecy has made a major impact on my life. As a matter of fact, I live by the word of prophecy. Um, I feel like I cannot do anything without consulting prophecy first, and then I move on it. Three specific ways that the power of prophecy has impacted my life. I would say number one was my decision making. Where I was going to school, um, what my profession would be in. Um, for example, I ended up going to college at Rutgers. I thought that I would not be able to get a degree. Um, it was the power of prophecy and the word that pushed me to go ahead and get the degree and look for the scholarships and look for the money to pay for me to go to school. And so the power of prophecy is why I ended up getting a degree. And then my career path. Um, there are still things in my career path that are not complete yet um, that I'm still looking forward to going into. But when I made decisions as to what work I was going to be doing, again, I consulted the power of prophecy. The work I'm doing today, I'm in sales because of a prophecy that I got maybe a year and a half ago. And I was working, just working at some job, some nine to five job. And I left my job on the word of the Lord. And I could not even imagine what I was walking into. And today I'm walking into some, something that I could not even ever think of even just two years ago. So it, it really affected my life there. And then the third way that um, the power of prophecy has affected me, I think in just development in general, like emotionally, like I wouldn't have been as strong as I am today because I leaned on the power of prophecy to be my spiritual mother, my spiritual father, I leaned on the power of prophecy where I didn't have any individuals to turn to. So it developed me in that way that today I can say that, you know, I'm much stronger than I was five years ago. Things that would have made me fold and crumble, you know, I kind of brushed them off a little bit easier or maybe I, um, they don't show or bother me as much. Well, how I was introduced to the power of prophecy as a young girl was I was living in foster care. Um, I grew up in foster care in New Jersey. My parents um, are in Africa. I had never met them before when I was introduced to the power of prophecy. Again, it was a word that I got around uh, 12 years old saying that I would go out and find my parents and my family and I would find them and reconnect with them. So I didn't do that until some ye you know, years after that, till I was 25. But um, it was my foster mother that introduced me to the Power of Prophecy. I am part of the Master Prophets business coaching, whereas though now I am being developed at an even greater level. Um, God has blessed me beyond measure um, once again, but now he's starting to structure my understanding of the level in which I am to be brought into. And so I needed the coaching. I need the coaching. I'm, I'm just starting it right now. I need it so that I can work out you know, my own business plan so that I can understand how to structure things, so that I can understand what level God is bringing me to, so that I can understand how to manage the money that God is bringing me to, so that I can understand all aspects of them and then bring them together. I wouldn't be able to do that on my own. That is the power of prophecy.